Hi everybody, how's everybody afternoon going? Um, I can tell you right now, mine has been a hot one this afternoon. My goodness, she's Florida. But if you guys are from here, visit here often, then you know, summertime, hurricane season, it's the worst. So get out while you can. <laughs> but not to dive in too much into that. My name is Sharon Holtz. I currently attend St. Petersburg College pursuing my bachelor's degree in public policy administration. And I can actually say I'm near the end. Whew. <laughs> Outside of that, I'm also working on a lot of my dreams and other accomplishments that I can just pretty much look back at myself and say, wow, Sharon, all the hard work. You did it, girl. Go. <laughs> so that's what I'm here to talk to you guys about. I'm here to talk to you about three of the more important things to me right now. And that's why I just want you guys to listen and hear me out. <laughs> so one of those things would be allowing my father to see me graduate college and actually walk across the stage. Yeah, that's really important. The other thing would be expanding and truly stepping out there with my current podcast. And the last thing is after all this is said and done, I really, truly would like to start my own mentoring program. So just to kind of dive into the first thing, that is me basically graduating college. A little background on that and why it's so important to me is, you know, you would think out of high school, just get through high school. And once you hit your senior year, it's really easy. Unfortunately for me, it was a little more difficult. Um, I definitely hit a lot of roadblocks my senior year of high school. And one of them would be me losing my mom. It was, it, I happened a couple of days before graduation and it really took a lot of my motivation. But during the school year for me, I also suffered from a couple of different health defects that also slowed down my motivation to just really want to get through the process. But once my mom died, that was the biggest thing for me. And when you lose a parent three days <laughs> before your high school graduation, it's tough. So here we are today, me being an adult, dealing with the different mental depressions and roadblocks that come along with getting over things like that. I promised my father that I'll let him see me graduate and walk across some type of stage. <laughs> that would be my college. So it's definitely exciting to be near the end and him being healthy enough to also see me be able to do this and him being 100% right by my side while I do it. So it's a big thing for me to really allow that to happen. The next thing is I am a co-host on a podcast. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> it's my one of my favorite outside of food, clothes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's one of my favorite pastime things to do. I got into the podcast not thinking much of it until I started and here I am 88 episodes in and I wanted to expand. I want it to become bigger. And the biggest goal for me for that is really allowing people to come to live shows and it's selling out, you know, make sponsorships. Me and my co-host work really hard. And some of the things that we're doing right now is we are actively promoting ourselves on social media. And you don't realize how much social media can help you. But in things like this, it's a big thing especially in a positive way. So that's a good turnaround for social media, <laughs> but it's very important um, to the both of us because, you know, we're, we're hardworking people. So we really want to see something that we put it our all into to really come out and shine through the years as we continue to do it. The last thing, my big baby is starting a mentoring program. I have dreamed of starting a, ment a mentoring program, basically helping young girls like myself go through the different um, roly roadblocks that we may face. And a lot of girls come stepping on top of different 
things that they may feel will stop them from moving forward and doing what they want to do with their life. And so it's really big for me to start my own mentoring program. Taking a class such as this, taking a class at like a speak for professionals will really help me and benefit me in the long run. So I really take a lot of things that I've learned so far and applying it to this benefit. Um, me meeting young girls and them catching on to my personality, which is really crazy, but they catch on to my personality and they, you know, seek advice from me. I have sisters and they're my biggest inspirations for this because, you know, they, they go through their teenage lives. And, you know, as a teenager, I didn't think I was that bad, but <laughs> As long as they have somebody that they can look up to and look towards to help them make the right decisions or just to be able to say it's just because one bad thing happens in life doesn't mean a million other things are going to happen that's going to stop you from being able to achieve your goals. So those are my most important aspirations right now and I am glad you guys got a chance to listen. Um, glad you took some time out today. <laughs> And thank you very much, and I really appreciate it. You guys have a good one.